Hello, my dear Leos. Welcome. Weekly forecast. Let's get started. September 16th until September 22nd, my dear Leos, let me start with love reading, whether you're a man or woman single or attached, and afterwards I'll talk about general aspect of your life. So let me see message for upcoming love week, who loves you, who wants you, what you can do or what you expect. The waiting game is over and I only can imagine that this is probably something that you want to hear and see. So probably you waited for someone or for something and guys my tarot cards will show what will happen. Let me see the next message. We'll start from there. Victory and success. So there you go, my dear Leos. You are wanted. Somebody wants you. The waiting game is over. I can see on your horizon only victory and success. And you are going to love that. Probably, you know, you done something or this person say or will say something very important to you. Guys, you can see this person is uh, standing on the cliff and you can see playing uh, the thorn. Uh, and this is like announcement. Leos, you can expect big announcement. There is also sense of a uh, risk because uh, this person is standing on the cliff and this is very 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 interesting very interesting so behind your back is some negativity behind your back is some waiting some unclear things unclear sentences unclear emotions but guys now you can see with your own two eyes the waiting game is over and clear answer this is exactly what you will get. This could be very profound seven days for you because it's easy for me guys, you know, to predict. Some of you can meet maybe another love partner. Some of you will finally, you know, leave this idea that only X of yours is like, you know, good enough for you, which is excellent. So you feel no stuck anymore you feel so good in your skin and in your body and you know therefore you will be as far as i can see successful in your love department now let me see more details what is really going on king of cups of course some of you are dealing already with a uh, scorpio cancer pisces this is king. This is very, very serious person. If you are a woman, this is a man, very serious man, who think only how to indulge you. And maybe this person want to buy some time, but not in some negative, you know, way. Maybe this person is preparing himself for a couple of surprises that he wants to share with you. This man thinks only seriously about engagement with you this is somebody who wants to hold you and this is somebody who has someone who wants to support you king of cups this man whatever this uh, guy is doing in his life everything is colored with emotions so i only can imagine there is spices um uh, cancer scorpio but guys remember could be any other zodiac sign this is general reading so someone is waiting on you for your clear answer for your move for sign for green light or something of that kind okay so everything kind of you know depends on you and you love that you love to have the power of your future Ace of Swords, honey, speak up, speak up, try not to hold, try not to swallow everything that you want to share 
with your love partner. Say it as it is. Don't hold back how much you love this person. Try not to do that. Forget about pride. Pride is not good in a love relationship at all. So, someone is waiting on someone. Um, and someone is waiting for your final answer or your decision or simply if you're single somebody wants to date with you but maybe kind of you are delaying maybe you are not sure how much you like or love this person so ace of swords is such a lovely tarot card which always will bring clarity what you want and where you are heading but above all mental clarity about your life can you picture yourself with in particular this person who stands right by your side of course if this is your partner of course the answer is yes and if you're single you can expect this king of cups which is watching uh, right into your direction already you can expect flirting and dating but just bear on your mind, this person is not about flirting with you, but everything will start with the flirting, because every single new love relationship only can start in a such a way, right? So be easy on him, give him time to express feelings and admiration for you. Ten of Cups is the very next tarot card, so guys, you can see, oh, this is such a beautiful tarot card, we can see a nice doggy a beautiful family and obviously you will get what you want so many of you will welcome new baby in your life some of you will buy a pet dog or a cat or maybe different type of a pet also so many of you will feel and you will be empowered to start um, with some charity work because you're happy you want to share your happiness with other people. Family will visit you or you will visit your family. If you're single, somewhere in a park or, or in some spa center or maybe in a church, you can meet this person. I can see so many of you being very active in a church core or maybe uh, starting to paint or any kind of art art uh, art activities visiting uh, beautiful places which uh, are connected with the artistry in general so guys lovely week as far as i can see and the final tarot card for your love reading is page of coins and i love to see page of coins because guys you know earth element only can give us uh, you know stability and longevity so whenever you see coins or pentacles which is the same uh, i know that this is going to be long lasting relationship also there is a pisces maybe you have a complicated relationship with these pisces you still do not know should you wait or should you give up on them but if you are dealing also with the capricorn taurus or virgo maybe this person is so much more and uh, represent so much more than even you can imagine in your life. So guys, remember, everything depends on you. Everything. Be wise uh, when it comes to choosing your next step. Above all, you are supported and you are loved by all family members. So this was love reading now let me see my dear friends what you can expect in general and those tarot cards could be connected with anything at all so let me see specific message for general reading the very first one is two of wands mid face choosing uh, something new let me see is this love friendship family marriage let me see this mid face what you are waiting for and what you are expect for oh my this is so weird 
two of wands and two of swords after such a long shuffling. Okay, guys, so this is easy for me to predict. I think that vast majority of you is kind of happy, more or less more happy uh, with almost every single area of your life. So many of you, I mean, you don't want to change anything at all. So many of you are grateful for all of those, you know, abundance that you enjoy in your life saying, you know, graces, you know, every single day or week, you know, how happy you are. You can see, though, some other people, maybe your friends or family members are not that happy as you are. Some of you want to help. Some of you will take care of someone. Some of you are waiting for something, for like a new direction. Guys, I think that so many of you also are in the mid phase of like, you know, choosing something new. You feel that this month of September and the rest of 2019 holds something big and very specific and very valuable to you. This very second, you cannot put the finger what this might be, but use this mid phase zone and time out. Maybe you don't have a job, maybe you're craving for a better job, maybe you're not very sure should you continue with your education. So guys, there is a milestone and there's like a threshold and you need to uh, you need to make your move. So before you do that, now it's time for you to pause and to consider your future venture where you see yourself in the next, let's say, two years. So choosing your future goal, uh, what kind of goal, where, with whom and why. So situation for some of you is a little bit unclear. You are not getting all kind of answers. Never mind that. The answer will come in the perfect moment. Just sleep on it. As your focus will and will improve, you will be able to make the right decision. I think this could be relationship with a Libra or Gemini. Maybe you expect from your partner, current or potential one, to show more, I don't know what, but more of something. And your partner also uh, want to share something with you. So many of you are very active. So many of you do not have as you want and as you need a free time with your partner. So guys, you know, do something for your partner and, you know, try to find more free time uh, for cuddling and for traveling, going to movies or anything what is your preferences. And this is your weekly prediction. Subscribe on my channel, guys. Call me, book a private reading. Share this video with your friends and like this video as well. God bless.